In this illustration, we will analyze the color of a flower pot. We are given that a thin transparent film of thickness 3000 angstrom and refractive index 1.5 is deposited on a sheet made of a metal. And assuming normal incidence of light and also that the film is parallel, we are required to find what will be the color of a flower pot made of this sheet when observed in a normal white light. So, we need to analyze the situation what happens to reflected light when white light normally incident on such a sheet. Say if the sheet is of thickness T and refractive index mu and a light normally incident onto it, then we already discussed in concept videos that the two light beams which will be reflected from upper and lower face the path difference can be directly calculated as 2 mu t minus lambda by 2. This we already discussed in concept videos. So, here we can write the path difference in reflected beams from the surfaces of sheet is this part difference we can write as delta is 2 mu t minus lambda by 2 and we are required to find what will be the color of light which is seen in reflected light that means we wish to find out that particular color which is having a strong intensity or constructive interference. So, we can write it equals to n lambda for a strong a reflection. Then in this situation, uh, we can further analyze that 2 mu t is equals to 2n plus 1 lambda by 2 and the value of uh, lambda we are getting here is uh, 4 mu t divided by 2n plus 1. If we substitute the numerical values, this 4 multiplied by mu is 1.5 and thickness is 3 into 10 to power minus 7 divided by 2 n plus 1 which is numerically given as 18 into 10 to power minus 7 divided by 2 n plus 1. So, for different values of n we are getting the values of wavelength which will be having a strong reflection in light. So, here we can write for n is equals to 0, 1, 2, 3 and so on. If we calculate the value of lambda, then you can see for n is equals to 0, the value of lambda is 18,000 angstrom. For n is equals to 1, it is 18 by 3, which is 6,000 angstrom. And then for n is equals to 2, it is 18 divided by 5. So, this will be 3600 angstrom and so on. We are not interested in other values because we are going to analyze the particular wavelength which is lying in white light range. So, here there is only one wavelength which is 6000 angstrom. So, we can write for 6000 angstrom a wavelength in white light. there will be strong reflection thus color of this wavelength will be dominating And the 6000 wavelength is in the range of yellowish orange kind of color, which is seen that is the result of this problem.